It's an exciting time to be doing rare earths chemistry. The rare earths are the lanthanides and yttrium and scandium, and they are used in very important renewable energy uh, technology applications, including hybrid electric fuel cell batteries and in the large capacity wind generator turbines uh, that you see, for example, on the Great Plains to generate electricity. In order to continue to deploy renewable energy technologies, we need a steady supply of rare earth elements. In the last 18 months, China, the world's primary supplier of rare earths, has dramatically cut their exports. And this has had a chilling effect on the rare earths market. In my lab, we're interested in new rare earths chemistry in the context of separations. We're interested in making new rare earth compounds in this inert atmosphere dry box and studying their electrochemical properties, where we look at how electricity flows between the compound and an electrode in order to characterize the compound. Using results from these kinds of studies, we hope to develop a new method for separating rare earths one from another such that they can be used in these renewable energy technology applications. I'm Eric Shelter, an assistant professor. This is my student, Jerome Robinson, and we're in the chemistry department at the University of Pennsylvania.